Good morning. <laughs> so we just spent the morning cleaning. We didn't get groceries or anything like we typically do on Fridays. We are going tomorrow. Ray is trying to get the camera. She's trying to headbutt me. But anyway, Brian has another dentist appointment today because last week was like an, There's I almost said inspection. Yeah, exam her butthole. <laughs> Sorry. But today you're getting a root canal, your first one ever. Yep. Do you uh, feel like an adult? Does that make you an adult? Getting a root canal? I guess. I don't know. Probably not. I have extremely soft teeth and I cracked one in half a while back and I had some temp work done and now I need a root canal. Yeah. So it's gonna be fun. I'm not in pain or anything, as you can tell. It's just gotta do it and it's not gonna be fun. So we'll see what I look like after. But let's see, hold on, compare my cheek. I wonder if I'll be swollen or anything. Wait, what side is it on? All right, hold on. This side. It'll be up here. She's kicking that. All right, we'll see when I get back. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is. Mm -hmm. oh. What about Mama? Baby, what about me? Oh no, she wants to kiss you. Mm. Oh, your little cheesy nose. Oh no, she just giving kisses. He's back. Hello. Oh. How you feeling? Two and a half hours. It was a long time. And I didn't even get impressions done for my crown because my gum was bleeding. And I have to go back on Wednesday, the day before Thanksgiving. I got surgery, oral surgery, when I was 13, the day before Thanksgiving. Cut into my gums. So don't even complain. Weird flex. Weird flex, but I had to let you know. <laughs> um, Go ahead. <laughs> but yeah, that was fun. A uh, root canal is nothing like getting a cavity done, let me tell you. I thought it was like a more intense cavity. Like, the, it's they clean your tooth. They drill into your gum. Oh, I know, I don't like that. And then that. they shove things into your nerves. I felt like the back of my head, like, on fire. It was like, ah, ah. But I was all numb. You were like, what? Show me that again? Yeah, no, it was fun. Yeah, but. All right, you, you guys want to hear some gross stuff, though? No. All right, so he's drilling, and then he put like a thing in, and he pulled it out. And I was like, did this motherfucker just take my tooth out? But like, I was scared. But like, he's like, oh no, this is something was necrotic. I was like, oh cool. And then I was like, oh, uh, I started smelling. Brian. Like he like dug in there, like it was my root. It was like, he said it died. I had like a dead root in my, that's a root canal. Brian. He pulled it out, and I was like, oh. It was fun. So, 10 out of 10 recommend. I'm in zero pain. And, uh, I, oh, when he was like, are you numb? And it was weird, cause like, he was really good at it this time, that like, I'm numb nowhere but like right here, just one spot. That's good. So, yeah, like, he was the, he's the dentist we've been going to for the past like year and a half, and he did my like deep root, my deep root, my deep gum cleaning, and he was like, do you want to be numbed? And I was like, I guess. So he did like a little bit, and I mean, it didn't numb oh, me. Yeah, he did it did, he it didn't did, numb me at yeah, all. Yeah, he put the candy. So the whole time I was white knuckling yeah. the seat, like no. tears gave, streaming down my face. He gave you, there's this candy jar thing, and he puts it on. Yeah, that's what he did. But like, no, he, he injected me. Good, I'm glad you got it. When he asked me, I was like, I don't know, man. I don't think I'm numb. He's like, I think you're numb. I was like, I don't think so. And then he like stabbed me. He's like, did you feel that? I was like, no. Nah. He's like, okay, you're numb. I was like, okay. It, it, he was really good at it this time because I I was like, you know how your tongue gets numb and like. The entire numb. mouth, yeah. Nope, it was just right here. Very cool. But yeah. Well, so. now what do we have to do? What do you mean? What's our next plan of action for today? Parent-teacher conference. Uh oh. Our yeah. first one ever. Let's see how it goes. So I changed into a sweatshirt because I was like, the shirt I was wearing was kind of like a crop top and I was like, Ugh. I don't want to have to like bend down to pick up Reagan or something and my belly be exposed. But I'm gonna put on some makeup because uh, one, I haven't worn makeup since Bennett's birthday party, which was mid-October and we're now mid-November. And two, I just want to look nice for this conference, I don't want her to look at me and be like, are you a child? Because 
Uh, low key, one of the more embarrassing things happened to me yesterday. <laughs> I don't know if Brian can hear me, but um, we're dropping Avery off at school and they have like older kids as like helpers in the mornings. And the older girl was like, um, is it just the back seat or the front seat too? And I was like, I look like a fifth grader. So fun. But yeah, so I'm just gonna put on some makeup, which again, like I said, I haven't done in a while and potentially film like a very small get ready with me. I have gotten rid of almost every makeup product I've ever owned. This is why I sell Tushy Clot Primer because I don't do makeup videos anymore. Uh, so I just keep the stuff that I've worn for years that I really like and a lot of eyeshadow because I like eyeshadow but that's about it so let's do some makeup. I'm not going to do anything crazy because we're not doing anything crazy today. Um, I think we're going to put off our Christmas pictures till, to our Amazonian clay till uh, this week so we'll probably do them sometime this week because I am not working for three days so you'll get a three day long potentially vlog this week so to the holiday so i think we're gonna put off pictures till this week which is 100 percent fine with me i actually feel like in this video i'm gonna have a lot to show you guys because i want to like i got a stitch fix i want to show you i have like stuff coming in the mail i want to show you i love showing you reagan because she's adorable and also Avery, of course, but Avery's at school right now, so you'll see her soon. This is the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer. This is okay. Um, I prefer the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer, but mine ran out and I haven't gone to the mall since. I mean, I guess I could order it, but like, I'm a little bit lazy, so this works. The color is like not the color I need so let me just like blend all this really quick and then this is the YSO I've had this for a really long time too radiant touch concealer I've had this for literally years like this probably should get thrown away but here we are actually I need to change um mascaras today and I have a ton of mascaras so that'll be fun so I have a lot of stuff in this makeup drawer that I have down. I'm just throwing everything that I have down here. I should probably go through that today. I also want to go through my skincare today or tomorrow because I a lot of it's unopened, but I've had it for years, so who knows how good it is, you know? This is um a Maybelline Total Temptation. Again, I've had a lot of this stuff for years because I used to be really big into makeup if you've been around my channel for a long time. I started my channel based on makeup. I guess we'll just like make a trash pile. And um, so I, I, you know, and I worked at Sephora, so I had a ton. I just kind of like, I don't know, I just kind of stopped wearing makeup every day because it just becomes a lot. So yeah, I don't know. So I'm gonna let my face sit. Brows, the Anastasia Clear Brow Gel. Because my brows are already like annoying, so I have like Scandinavian eyebrows, so I just need to maintain them as much as possible. And then let's also prime Urban Decay Primer Potion. I miss when it was in like a little, not, not a squeezy tube. Set the face. This is um, off a recommendation from Andrea many moons ago, the Too Faced Cocoa Powder Foundation. Like I said, I've had this for many moons i've actually hit pan on it though which is surprising i do think though that if i ever run out of this i'll probably just buy like a drugstore powder because like i don't care to be quite honest then i have the little rock pro contour palette which andrea got me when i first moved to austin so five years ago i don't know why i'm doing a full face but I feel like I just get so used to doing the same thing that it's just like easy. I'm gonna show you guys Brian's reaction too, because I, like I said, I don't wear makeup ever. So, boy, that goes. I guess that goes here. Yeah. This is the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Palette. I've had this since California, so seven years ago. Sounds about right. Hit pan on it too. 
It's super pretty. Okay, this is the Naked Basics palette from Urban Decay. I use this to just kind of like set my eyes. I use either one of those it does not matter and i'm gonna do like a basic look today i think uh-oh so let me find some eyeshadow i have all the urban decay not all of them actually because they've come out with many more i have one two and three plus the basics i'm just gonna use the original naked palette it's so good like i don't know let's just let's just come up with something i don't know baby girl what are you doing ah! oh geez sister I'm just using a bunch of like browns right now. Ah. What? I know. Put those back, please. Please. Can you go? Can you go put those somewhere, please? Thank you very much. Let's use a sh Ooh, let's use sin. Sin is the best color. When I was in high school, my combination for my eyes was always sin and mushroom from Urban Decay. I had like a little sample that came in the mail. It lasted me like my entire junior year. It was crazy. Um, yeah. This is not the best eye work I've done, but it'll do. Stila stay all day waterproof. Reggie, please put that back. I can't see in this mirror. Reggie, please put that back. Ow. If you love me. Um, uneven, but I'd rather not fix, so. Shh, Isa, we're just gonna deal with it. Alright, this is Urban Decay 24-7 liner, zero. Do I want to use black? No. I don't want to use black. Let's do this one. Smoke out. This one needs to be sharpened, but whatever. Not like black, so it's not, I don't know, super dark and harsh. Which I don't mind, but not today. Not for a parent-teacher conference. Okay, so then I'm gonna try those new mascaras. This one's like weird. Total Temptation. Oh, I like this. I don't even know if they still sell this. We tested making wax melts for like a month before we found like our groove of what we like to do. So we have a big container, just like we call them crap wax melts because they kind of are. But they were like our testers. This mascara is actually pretty long. So she's just going through those right now. Um. Oh, she's smelling them. Oh, you can't even see her. She's so cute. They smell good? They smell good, huh, honey? Just you wait. Mama's got one coming that you're gonna love, baby girl. You hear her? Oh no, my camera's dying. That's okay. And this is their reel by Benefit. This is amazing. Hopefully I don't look like, I mean, I feel like I look different to y'all because y'all are so used to seeing me with no makeup on, so. That's fine. Blush. Oh, I'm gonna wear my favorite. This was the first blush I ever bought, ever in my entire life. I've repurchased this. Um, but I wore it on my wedding day because I love it so much. It's an Ulta one in Afternoon Delight. It's the best. I wore it on my wedding day because it's super pretty and it was literally the first blush I ever purchased in my entire life. This one I wore on my wedding day too. This is the Laura Mercier Highlight 01. It's so pretty and it like, this is a little sample size. It looks really good on if you're like fair. Well, to be fair though, when I, have to be fair, I did when I worked at Sephora, I put this on medium skin tone people and it would look really pretty too. Uh, lip color, none. Chapstick. Should I spray? I'll spray. It's something. Are you smelling it? This is what I was talking about. This was our first one we ever made. We had to make it in a soap container because we didn't have anything. But seriously, guys, like, just just testers, you know, casual testers. You smell one? Good? I don't know. That one smelled weird, I thought. Yeah, just... Testing toppings and all sorts of stuff. We cleaned our player room a little bit. Well, not Daddy's room though. Oh no, no reaction to my face. You got a face. What? Thanks, baby. Worked really hard for like 15 minutes on this. 
if I said I couldn't even tell, wouldn't that be like- That would hurt really me? bad. Do you see what Sissy has? Oh. Reggie, come here. I was just trying to be nice. I don't come know. Come here, show daddy what you got. Obviously tell. You see what Reggie has? Look. What is that? Oh, soaps. Is that soap, Ryan? When did we make soap? With a soap mold. I know. That's what I call them. Reggie. I feel like I look like a person. to watch Reagan. She just took a nap though, or she's sleeping right now. Um, well, I actually go film a little bit for this week. I still want to have a three, my skin looks wet. I still want to have three videos up this week, but I know this week is going to be very hectic with the holidays and with Black Friday and I'm just already stressed. So I kind of think instead of doing two plan with me's this week, I'm going to do one plan with me and one haul. So I'm gonna film the haul now, so that way I don't even have to worry about that. And the plan with me, I can film tomorrow. And then I just have this vlog, which is like, currently in the process of being filmed. So, yeah, I'm excited too, because I got a couple of shirts I wanna show in this haul. They're so cute, and I just really wanna wear them. So, I'm gonna offload this camera and start filming. Um, I'm not sure, Avery's home from school. Do you wanna come say hi? And she gets a whole week off for Thanksgiving. So next week, Avery, you don't have school. <laughs> um, Brian checks the mail after and he mom, grabs Avery. What, what? Guess what my snack was? What was your snack? It was a ice cream and a cup. You got an ice cream today? Yeah. And you it, spent money. And inside a cup. Very cool. Give me a kiss. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to show you stuff, okay? I love you. Go play. Eat your cereal. Bye. Anyway, so when Brian picks up Avery, he always checks the mail. And today was actually a pretty happy mail day. I also have a stitch fix upstairs I want to show you guys. So I don't know if you guys like more montage type vlogs or if you like more sit down talk type vlogs. Let me know. I don't care either way. I don't mind. Uh, I just don't want it to be super talkative and you guys be like, this is a little bit much, Kirsten. So I did get an order from Once More With Love. So I'll show that in a haul. Can I eat my cereal? It's the toy room. Um, cleaned up. Hmm? Wait, I'm gonna go check before you Go check. Cereal. Go check. And then I did order these from Amazon, but I think I'm gonna clean them with peroxide before I put them in my ears because like, I don't know. But they, I really wanted some like wintry plugs. I've had my ears stretched since I was 16, so 10 years. But look at these, they're like little plugs that are snowflakes. And they're super cute, but I think I'm gonna clean them just cause I'm a little bit nervous about it. If you guys have stretched ears, where do you get your plugs? Because like, I just mostly stick to like silicone tunnels and sometimes I'll use like the opal plugs, but I feel like those fall out really easy. So I need them to be double flared. So if you guys have stretched ears, just let me know where you get your plugs. Cause I'm interested. And then I did place a Sephora order. I haven't ordered from Sephora in years. Obviously I'm wearing makeup today, but I don't normally wear makeup. So I needed to order some skincare cause my skin's like, I'm noticing signs of aging, but I also have like blackheads and stuff. Like it's, I'm a mess. Like my skin thinks I'm 13 and also 40. So super fun. I uh, got some samples of stuff. Excited to try those. But I purchased from Ula Henriksen because I know this brand. I trust this brand. I've used them before. Brian and I actually have met him before, which is cool. So I got the three little wonder set to try. These sizes are actually really great. I've tried this before. I know I like it, but I didn't really use the truth serum too much when I was younger because I didn't think I needed it, but like whatever. So it does come with the truth serum, the sheer transformation moisturizer, which I'm really excited about because I have really dry skin. And then this I need. This is the invigorating night transformation gel. This is really good for acne. And I noticed that this didn't come with a eye cream, which is where I've been noticing more signs of aging. So I bought this um, I think this was a set because I wanted to not spend as much money. This is the Your Best Selfie Brightening Moisturizer and Eye Cream set. So maybe I can use that Sheer Transformation at night and I'll use this one during the day. And this is the moisturizer. This is like something you would get at the like to go section. What's it called now? I don't know. This is the, oh, this is the gel cream and this is the eye cream. Is this both eye creams? I think it is. No moisturizer and eye cream set, whatever, I don't care. Hopefully I can get a new skincare routine down because... <laughs> Put them in. 
They're pretty. I definitely think I'm gonna have to take them out at night though because they're a little heavy and they hurt just a, a tiny bit. Can you please go put those away? We're about to go get food. Just, this one just snacks so much. I feel like I look dirty. Anywho, uh, we have to wake up Reagan because we ordered Buffalo Wild Wings for dinner. Nobody felt like cooking. To be fair, I never feel like cooking. So, we got Buffalo Wild Wings for dinner. <laughs> Haven't had Buffalo Wild Wings. <laughs> No, we didn't, we had it once when we moved here, but it was before Reagan, right? Mm. I'm gonna say it was before Reagan, because we started going to Pluckers, but we have to wake up Reagan. Watch out, go get your Crocs on. Go wake up to sleeping, baby. Reagan, you want some food? Mama, is you gonna go get some food? <laughs> Look, sis, he's home. Oh, okay. You wanna go get, aw. Do you wanna go get some food, baby? Eat, eat. Let's go, let's go. Good morning, Cameron. Good Saturday morning. Five more days and Thanksgiving. <laughs> we went to HEB and got some groceries. Come on, Mama. Should I take him get you? Okay. Oh my gosh. Whew. Anyway, we're home now. I'm out of breath. You say hi, Mama. Mm, she said. Anyway, we got groceries from HEB. We didn't get too much because this week is Thanksgiving and we already have a lot of stuff. I got something in the mail though that I wanted to share with you guys. Just chug some water so I feel a little bit better. Anyway, I got this in the mail today. I found this shop. It's called, I think it's Zippity Tees. And they came out with the coolest Grinch pullover. And I was like, I need this. I need this. But what would I wear? That's so cute. I love the color. I'm so hyped to get a picture in this. She's just chasing me. But anyway, so our plan for today, let me just sit on the bed because I don't feel like oh, I'm moving. I actually might be tired, so maybe I'll put her to sleep. I'm not tired, so that's good. But plan for today, she's trying to nap. She's grabbed a blanket. <laughs> oh, you're sweet. Okay, okay. Plan for today is to um, do some laundry, which isn't crazy. And I need to film my plan with me. Even if I just get the base yeah. done, I'm cool with that. Sorry. Um, but I would like to get the whole thing done today, if at all possible. I'm just gonna turn you this way. And laundry, as always. And then I would also like to get all of our first rounds of all of our new releases for Black Friday done today so I can get pictures done today. Because if I can get pictures done today, that cuts a lot of my time in half, which would be cool. So hopefully we can get one of each round done of the new scents for the Christmas bundle, which I'm really excited about. It's like Disney Christmas themed. We did a Disney Disney Halloween for the Not So Scary, and we're doing Very Merry for like Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party. Your little hand is stuck. <laughs> so I'd like to get that done today, but I would also just like today to be as relaxing as possible because I go back to work tomorrow. I'm only working three days and then I'm taking three days off next week, which I'm very excited about. Who, what? She doesn't want to have hands. <laughs> Why are you the way you are? <laughs> Anywho. That's the plan. I've been doing my skincare. I did skincare last night and this morning. My face feels like a baby's butt and it smells like oranges, so that's probably good. Maybe I'll just lay here with her for like an hour and take a nap. We shall see. This is like really bright, so I apologize. I just got finished filming. Oh, uh, my plan with me. Oh, is there something on the lens? Cause I just filmed for like ever. 
I hope not. <laughs> Anyway, I just got finished filming the base for my plan with me that you should have already seen on Monday. Um, as you guys saw, I took a nap. We've been trying to get, oh, I didn't put the thing down. I'll just save it for when I film again. Um, we've been trying to get Reagan down for the past four hours to take a nap and she's just not tired and I don't understand. And I know if she takes a nap now, it's gonna really screw us for tonight. So maybe we just keep her up. I don't know, I think Brian might have gone her to sleep though. Ugh. Yeah, she might be asleep. So that's fun. But I just got finished filming, like I said. I tried, in turn, trying to get Reagan to nap. I took a nap. Tired, always. But yeah, so filmed, haven't done any laundry. Yeah, I'll probably do a load tonight. And then we gotta go work on wax. Chef Brian over here. Making the lobster and shrimp ravioli with broccoli. Hold on, let me see if I can get a ravioli. Oh my god. Wow, babe. Look at you. I feel even focus on you. Look at you. We haven't vlogged in a very long time. Both girls took a nap. What are you doing? What? You're so annoying. Both girls are we're taking a nap. So I was able to film, and Brian played Spider-Man. Almost done, I'm about to beat the game. And now we're, kids are watching Bear Bears, and it's so loud because we have the fan on. So, so I don't wanna die. And we're making wax. You can show me. Yeah? Can show me the things. Then we have the mold ready to go, or four molds, I should say. These are for the freebies. Uh, we're testing every color out really quickly just to make sure that we have the right colors for freebies. But after that, it's bundle time. Hi. Mmm, make you smell. Is that delish? Yeah. Baby. Oh, okay. I think she just said a bad word. Okay. Got the first like batch of these little tarts done. They're super, super cute. I'm so excited and they smell amazing. And then I did one round of each of the new scents. The gingerbread one turned out like really cute. But I mean, I think they're all pretty freaking cute. So I have to get pictures of these now to post on Instagram. or at least I can hear her scooting down the stairs. We are done with the pictures um, and it is 9.59 at night. I wanna go to bed because I have to work tomorrow and I'm very tired. But I'm happy that at least this is done and now we're just gonna spend this week. She did follow me. Okay, so that is it 
for today for this vlog. I forgot to show y'all Stitch Fix. Let me go do that real quick. All right, so we're gonna do Stitch Fix in the playroom because our room is set up for bedtime, but her room's set up for bedtime, yes. but are they gonna go to bed? Mm -hmm. Probably not. Um, I figured I would show you quickly because we have to return some of these things this week. So, and I don't feel like making a separate video. So, there's all my information. If you've watched any of my Stitch Fix videos before, you'll kind of understand my style. They sent me shoes this time, which I haven't gotten shoes in a very long time. And these are super cute. These are the Mia Smith faux leather booty and tote. <laughs> These are super, is that the word booty? <laughs> These are cute. It's so chaotic in this house on a 10 o'clock on a Saturday night. The booties, I'll probably keep. They're pretty cute. This cardigan is, I'll say it again, Vigos Harmony double pocket hooded cardigan in camel. I'm thinking about keeping this because it's really huge really soft, very long, it has a hood, it's thick, like she thick, but she feels really nice. I will probably keep this as well, because that's super soft. Um, I'm not even gonna go through prices, this isn't like an official Stitch Fix video, so it's fine. Um, this is cute, I would keep it, but I, I don't know. Um, this is from Pistola, which is like one of my favorite jean brands, which would make sense why I would like this mealy top off white it's a t-shirt flannel i have one of these from vans this one's a little thick and it has a um buttons down the back this one's like a thicker material which is really nice the one i have from vans i call my rachel green shirt because it's like really loose fitting really comfy and thin it's like a summer one but this would be really cute under that cardigan so maybe maybe i'll keep this I don't know, I really like it. That's actually really cute. Um, this, I initially said no to, but I also really like it. <laughs> this sucks, because I actually really like this. This is from Pink Clover, Nicole Textured Pullover in Beige. I was like, oh, this is really basic by itself, but the more I was thinking about this top, I have a really cute rust colored um, dress. This would look so cute just over it, and then the rust colored dress could be a skirt. like. This is just so cute and it's like, it's thick, but it's loose fitting. So it's like a thick sweater material, but it's not like structured, if that makes sense. I don't know. I love the colors of this fix. And then the last thing, I don't know if I'll keep, um, if I don't end up keeping these, I'll probably send another thing back as well. Cause it makes a lot of sense to keep all five cause you get 25% off then. Um, so then whatever would be essentially free. I need to try these on though. These are from, Gaia M, Gaia M, Gaia M, Cassidy O M High Rise Relax Performance Leggings in Black. There's basic black leggings. Um, I'll just try them on and give, give them a try. I don't know, but like I said, if I don't end up keeping those, one of these will just get sent back because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna keep the cardigan and the shoes. I just need to try everything on again because I tried it all, all on when I got it officially, but like. That's it. I need to go do my skincare routine and go to bed. I'm so tired, y'all. We are in for the biggest, busiest, biggest week of our lives, and I'm just like, I'm so tired. Do you like this blink wall? Pink blink wall? Do you like this pink wall? It's cute. Okay, good night. Hope you enjoyed this vlog. Let me know if you like longer, chattier, shorter, montage. I don't care. Or a mix. I feel like this could be a mix. We'll see. Okay, bye.